Last year, the Grand Rapids boys hockey team made it to their first state tournament in nine years. Now, after a third place finish a year ago, the Thunderhawks are headed back to state with an even bigger goal. After a 27-1 season and a thrilling 3-2 double overtime victory in the section championship, the Grand Rapids boys hockey team is heading back to state. I think if you went 20 times, it would be just as exciting every time. So a uh, great group of guys, really looking forward to it. Can't wait to get down there. Everyone thought it was fantastic last year. It's just the greatest event you know, of everyone's lives here. So it's going to be fun going back and experiencing that again. But a three-game losing streak right before section tournament time. And those three games is just like a wart that everybody asks about. Had many worried the Thunderhawks wouldn't make it. It was just one of those stretches where it wasn't good for us. Um, but I, I actually like instances like that because you uh, you get to see what the kids are made of. But with their backs against the wall, the team righted their ship just in the nick of time. It was definitely, you know, if we don't play good now, the season can be over, and I don't think anyone wanted that to happen, so we really rallied the troops and started playing good hockey like we know we could. And now with 12 players returning from last year's third-place team, the Thunderhawks are looking to take care of some unfinished business and capture their first state title since 1980. They want to win, plain and simple. I mean, uh, you know, we may lose two games and be home Friday night, but this team wants to win three games, and that's their goal. It's been that all year long, and I have no reason to doubt these guys, so we'll see what happens. I have a lot of confidence in this group. Uh, I've known these guys for my whole life. You know, we've done a lot of special things in the past, and you know, now it's time for us to do something right here, right now. I know we're all thinking that, that we can do it, so we just gotta go on and grind, and we know that we can take out any team in the state right now. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.